All right, is it working? Yo, ever since the cooking stream, right? A lot of you guys have seen my brother. I had a, an idea that I would do a gym stream with him. He's like a licensed personal trainer and everything. So that's my little brother. He, little brother, by the way. Yeah, he just turned 19 and, <laughs> and he's completely natural. <laughs> when we used to work out years ago, his uh, stomach consists of the only thing he would tell me is that I was either weak or to kill myself. That's it. <laughs> and then now all of a sudden, dude, he's fucking Mr. Motivational, bro. Like. All right, Chad, now the question is, does he do more or less than me? Yeah. Look, everyone's saying you did zero reps. Nice way Chat, to chat, bro. <laughs> this is the most scuffed setup, all right? He's one of those guys where it's like he says he did 50 reps, but he actually did zero because the range of motion isn't there. <laughs> Funny story, he'd actually get in a lot of Instagram wars in his like comment section of some of the posts he would do because people would tell him that his like range of motion was bad. So then he would either just call them ugly or tell them to kill themselves. Guys, guys, if you look better than someone and they tell you that you don't know how to do an exercise, just call them ugly. That's all you, that's all you need to do. Negative cantal tilt, recessed jaw, the list goes on. You know, Mateo, when you say, you know, if, if someone tells you, you call him this, you call him that. A lion doesn't turn around every time a little dog barks at him. Not true. Meaning, <laughs> some comments you just, I mean, come on. Not true. A lion doesn't turn around every time a little dog. <laughs> Tell me what your stream says about my quote. They said W, w dad. W, yeah. Dad. <laughs> yeah, baby. Wait, guys, you know that there's actually only a one year difference between me and him? Bro, you're getting skull mogged like crazy right now. <laughs> you fucking retard. I'm not. What is skull mogged? My head size. I have a, a warrior skull, you have a wimp skull. <laughs> <laughs> I do not have a fucking wimp skull. Are you retarded? Bro, Look at the arm size diff. No, my arms are good. Fuck off. I don't know, chat. What do you guys think? <laughs> Who's the little midget next to the Giga Chad? <laughs> <laughs> you just have two heads or whatever. Can't that screw your lower back? Not if you're an alpha. Oh. <laughs> guys, if you're a Giga Chad, you never get injured in the gym. If you're a pussy wimp, that's how you get injured. <laughs> Tell me that again about your shoulder injury two years ago. <laughs> Yo, that was what shoulder injury. <laughs> Never got injured in my life. That with the exposed. Your brother got all the good genes. You got all the fucked up genes. <laughs> why are you laughing? You gave them to me. <laughs> the thing is that the only reason why you think your physique looks good is because of how into the gym scene you are. If a caveman were to see you, he thinks you're like a genetic abomination. <laughs> but that's even better. I'm literally superhuman. Superhuman mogger. Dude, you're not a superhuman mogger. What the f Guys, he comes up to me today and he tells me that he needs to start deep voice maxing because on one of the YouTube shorts comments, a girl said that his voice doesn't fit his physique. Yeah, so now I have to talk like this the whole time. So he said he's going to start deep voice maxing. For years, he was trying to convince my parents that he needed plastic surgery because his eyebrows weren't hooded enough and he wanted like hunter eyes like this dude yeah but then i realized that it's all about facial harmony at the end well, of the day what about the latest one about the one side of your jaw guys also make sure you chew on both sides of your jaw equally because i have a slight asymmetry with my right masseter muscle it's a bit more developed on my left one so what i started doing i stopped chewing my right side only my left side but hopefully in a few years guys we'll have a symmetrical jaw you have the physique of a ninja but the mindset of a jello oh slave help me with the plate <laughs> What the, what you call me, dude? You can't just start calling me fucking gym slave. Yo, I'm skull mogging you as you're putting on my plate. I can't do it yourself. You want to be the big man? Go do it yourself. <laughs> when is your dad gonna do a shirtless stream? <laughs> my job, streaming and playing video games, is harder than my dad's when he was in the military. Because the thing is, when you're in the army, someone tells you what to do. When you're a streamer, you're figuring it all out on your own. And you have to deal with people like flaming you in Twitch chat and shit. What's harder, doing what you want or doing something even if you hate it because you have to and it's an order? You know? The first one, because it's easy when someone's telling you what to do. Do you know how hard it is for me mentally to play video games 12 hours a day? So if I tell you right now, okay, it's gonna be easy because I tell you to do something. Do 75 push-ups. It's not chess day. <laughs> no, it's really not. We know chat, this is actually like the funniest thing though because people ask me like, Dude, how come you can do like streams with Tarsin and shit where he's like flaming you and stuff? Like I'm very used to the younger brother vibe of like, I conditioned him. But the way you're behaving towards each other is a uh, thousand percent better than when you were younger. <laughs> it was physical uh, fighting when you were younger. One time in a hotel room, he did like- the Roundhouse kick. Yeah, he, he wanted to practice his roundhouse kick. So he roundhouse kicked me in the throat and I couldn't breathe for a minute and I almost died. I was training your throat muscles. Dude, no, are you fucking retarded? I was 
see how much you can resist. Dude, you're making it sound Cooper, you fucking suit. You know how that sounds? <laughs> no, no, no. Chat, no. It's not what I meant. <laughs> Holy shit. See, the thing is, guys, you wouldn't be able to tell, but me and him actually spent years browsing red pill and black pill forums and shit like I that. I still do. Dude, he's the kind of guy, he's the kind of guy, he'll call himself like an incel, literally. Like, he'll be like, oh, it's so over for us, dude. <laughs> you know when you have like the fake cells? He's legit the biggest like fake cell of all time, dude. <laughs> guys, I'm all for improving yourself in every aspect, so that's so, why. Even if you're not an incel, you have to think of yourself as an incel. <laughs> so you want to strive for greatness. Back in the day, and I'm being serious one of his favorite pastimes was he would sit there shirtless wear these sunglasses <laughs> go on omegle for three hours straight and just call people ugly and like start like flexing on them true and shit. just of his own free will come on guys if you get called ugly by this on omegle you can't say shit bro <laughs> you can't say shit Guys, what if I told you that how mental I am when it comes to, like, lost streak and wind streak is how mental my brother is when it comes to, like, people's, like, facial appearances and shit. I'll tell you guys how autistic I was at some point. What I used to do was, I used to go back to old pictures of Ziz. I used to calculate the pixels from the long head of his tricep insertion to his elbow. And I used to try to use the pixels, get a ruler, and try to measure with a ruler if my long head to my fucking elbow was like a good tricep insertion. <laughs> like, th those are the levels that I go to, bro, to make sure that I'm the fucking shit. To make sure that I'm the shit. When the shit in question is calling random people in an Instagram comment section ugly. Only because they're flaming me. If I'm not getting flamed, I won't call them ugly. But once I get flamed, then I gotta say it. Wait, okay, I have a question. Mm. What's your opinion on democracy? I'd rather you have one Giga Chad leader that makes the rules and have like a lot of idiots saying dumb shit. Like I should be president of the world, honestly. <laughs> Who wouldn't want this as their president? <laughs> President Mog. Free gym memberships for all. Free looks maxing for everybody. He would get in like a, a foreign uh, like fucking bullshit whatever war. And then instead of like sending the army, he'd just like go alone and be like, if I skull mod you, I win. If you skull mod me, you win. Oh, That's how you gotta do it. He's natty on TRT. <laughs> Listen, here's the unpopular take. People take protein powder, and protein powder is just like a way to get more protein, and people consider that natural. Then if people take like testosterone, and you already naturally have testosterone, then it's also natural, because you're just getting it's more. It's just a supplement. Trend is just a supplement, guys, that's yep. legit true. What if I told you that I've been mewing since before I was even born? When I was born, and the doctors like took me out of my mom's vagina, dude. I didn't have the umbilical cord attached to my fucking belly button. I had it in my mouth. I was legit in the fucking womb. Fucking umbilical cord, dude. Fucking like mewing on that shit. Legit. True story. Yep. I saw it. Dude, it's crazy to think that you're only 15 though. Well, I turned 16 in like a month. So. Like, I don't know. It's crazy because like when he goes to the high school, like nobody believes that he's actually 15. Yeah. Like they all think he's like in his 30s and shit. But it's like I tell him like, no, like that's your my little brother. Like he's actually 15. Look, prove you're 15 right now. Skibbity toilet Riz. <laughs> Skibbity toilet. See guys, I'm 15. <laughs> Skibbity toilet Riz. <laughs> Skibbity toilet Ohio Gas. Yeah, yeah. Bro, I'm telling you, that form is from Ohio that you've been doing today. <laughs> <laughs> bro, you got no riz with that fucking roll right there. What the fuck is that Ohio for? <laughs> Shut up, that's not Ohio. Bro, you're humping the fucking ground, dude. Dantes, how did you ever build muscle with that form? Because this is the real fucking red pill about the whole gym scene. As long as you go to the gym every day, it doesn't matter what you do. Over the course of years, you'll make progress. You could literally fucking go to the gym and just jerk off in the bathroom, dude. And you'll literally look like fucking Arnold, bro. After a couple years. You are living proof that that's wrong. Bro, that's a goofy comment, I'm gonna be honest. Yo, Mateo. What? You have a goofy goniel angle. Dude, I could dissect your face right now and you grow back. <laughs> okay, do it then, pussy. Let's start from the side profile. All right, the Ramus is okay. Deep goniel angle though. A bit of hyoid fat. Filtrum to chin ratio is not it. A bit of a bulbous nose from the front. <laughs> See some under eye bags due to lack of sleep. This eyebrow slit's gotta go. <laughs> Derma roll the eyebrows. Thicker eyebrows, minimal eyelid exposure, okay. You gotta work on your neck. And uh, the physique, don't even get me started on that one right there. What, what's wrong with this? My physique is- Start eating more, lifting heavy. Nah, that's cope. Eat, eating more is cope, legit. Well, listen, eat better. Cause you, uh, bro, when I see you eat this, uh, I don't know, man. Coming from you, you come down at fucking 1 a.m. and you eat cakes and shit. This guy, he's like the most insane, like, closet eater ever. He comes down at 1 a.m. and he'll just eat an entire bag of grapes 
And then the next morning he lies about it. Guys, it didn't happen if no one saw it. <laughs> if no one saw it, it didn't happen. I used to have trust issues as a toddler. So I always never believed that my mom was like telling me the truth when she told me that she was my mom. So I asked her for video evidence of her giving birth to me because I had trust issues that she was my real mom. Wait, I just saw a comment. What do you do for neck? I'm not gonna put it on though. Guys, this is a neck harness. So you attach this no, shit to your- No, put it on. No, I'm putting it on. <laughs> I'm not putting it on. Put it on. All right, so you put this shit around your head <laughs> and you attach the, the plates to this fucking chain. And then you just do like curls like... You do like... Put it on. I'll put it on you. No, <laughs> <laughs> so he has to take the chain to your dog. No, that's... that's, that's <laughs> yeah, I'll hold the chain. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, I need my glasses. <laughs> Guys, without glasses, with glasses. <laughs> Wait, guys, so by the time I got that dog in me. <laughs> Guys, I've done that. Guys! <laughs> <Hard. laughs> Who's stronger, you or Tyler won? Probably Tyler. Your brother didn't random check Tyler? I mean, me and my brother started League at the same time, but I played played Overwatch, CSGO, a bunch of shit, honestly. But Dauntless was the only one uh, who had enough mental illnesses to stick with League for 20 hours a day oh my God. for uh, 10 years. Uh, the funniest story about me and my brother with League, one day I'm streaming. And at this point, keep in mind my Grandmaster, okay? My brother's plat one. One win from Diamond, two and two, Master promos. <laughs> he comes to my room, he's like, Dauntless, look, I just want to hit Diamond, bro. Can you duel with me one game? And I was like, nah, I'm streaming, you know, I can't. He queues up for a game, plays against famous Nubrak on Amumu Jungle. Yep. That's the guy that got in the drama with Nightblue years ago because he would fucking sit there and play Teemo like duo lane. Nubrak randomly steals the Baron 40 <laughs> minutes in, Solo wins his team the game. My brother loses his promos and quits League for like a year because of that. Oh my God, I saw the funniest thing ever. Bro, Taylor Swift has this like private jet and you know she like literally drives the private jet like 20 minutes. So like let's say there's like a thing that's like a 30 minute drive. Yeah. Instead of driving, she takes her private jet. <laughs> yes. That's, that's literally retarded. <laughs> I saw this tweet where the private jet was literally in the air for 10 minutes. She literally like flew it 10 minutes, but it would have been a 25 minute drive. <laughs> that's legit right <laughs> Is Dantas always retarded or is it just a character? It's not a character. <laughs> I, know, I know a lot of you guys think it's a character, but literally every story he says is actually real. And this is literally how we act. Literally, sometimes I'm in my family knows when I'm like trolling or not. I just be saying shit to say shit sometimes. Hold on, hold on. Hold on to me or something. Oh shit, okay. versus virgin retard <laughs> dude guys keep in mind that i'm the one that entertains you at the end of the day so why is everyone turning on me also the fact that i'm 15 yeah legit you're, you're legit six years older than me you guys understand that i'm the bigger brother right like people don't believe me when i tell them he's 15 i'm 15 guys 16 next month literally his birthday is in yeah, march march yeah Guys, so if I told you that my brother back in the day when he used to be on Tinder and shit, sometimes he wouldn't want to pay for a motel. So he would just bring girls like into the forest and they would just like have sex in the forest at like midnight or some shit. Cheap date idea, boys. I'm going to give you all a pro tip right now on how to solve your wrist pain as a gamer. A lot of people think that you have to like play around with your wrist like this. That's not true. You need to actually massage this part because it's this part that actually is like the reason for a lot of wrist pain. So if you massage this part of your arm right now and you have wrist pain, that it actually helps alleviate it a lot. The brother has face hair, Dantas has ass hair. <laughs> Why is that even, how's that even funny, bro? <laughs> That's actually funny. What's Dantas bro's cycle? Guys, this is what I do. I, I never lifted a weight in my life. Yin yoga, it's how you look like this. Yoga and uh, Pilates. Even the man on the CD <laughs> cover mogs, Dantas. <laughs> Guys, shut the fuck up. I don't get mogged by Mark Laham, dude. <laughs> this guy does not mog me. 
I don't know, guys. One for Mark, two for Dantas. No, I no, I legit look better. You can't say anything. A few years back, I watched the grapefruit technique on YouTube. And then I said, what if I tried this at home by myself? So what I did was I got home, but the thing is my mom took away my computer. So I went in my brother's room and I grabbed a grapefruit. I cut a hole in the middle of it and I started putting it on my penis and like jacking it. But the problem was the first time I made the hole too small. So the juice was flying everywhere. And then the second time I made made the hole too big so then what happened was i had to squeeze too hard to make it tight and then the juice was flying everywhere even more so after about 10 minutes i stopped doing it so then my brother gets home and he's like dude why is my keyboard all sticky so i said i was like oh shit it's because i was eating a grapefruit he's like dude why is there a hole in the middle of the grapefruit <laughs> but that was your own computer <laughs> not this one get this man away from grapefruits <laughs> All right, anyways, guys, so that's going to be it for the uh, gym stream. want to thank you guys all for coming out. And the next time I see you guys should be in Disney before we end up doing a three-week EU grind. you have any last words? Gym Max, looks Max. Remember, guys, if someone looks worse than you, no matter what kind of PhD they have, call them ugly, dissect their facial features, negative cantle tilt, recessed jaw. All right. Well, all right. Thank you, guys. Love you, guys. Thank you for watching. Let us know what you thought of the video by leaving a silly goofy comment, and make sure to drop a like to spread the gospel. And this is only the first step.